But this week we wanted to do a couple of things. We're going to show you our one-click website. Carlos is going to take a few minutes and show you what we've been working on for iHome Finder. And we also have the same uh, product for, for IDX Broker. And then Maida is going to take a few minutes and show you some of the new uh, features we've been working on. So let's, and then we'll do some Q&A. Carlos, do you want to dive in and show us what you got? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Hello, everybody. I'm Carlos. Um, I'm the lead developer on IDX apps. And I, I want to show you how you can have a high-level website integrated with iPhone Finder. So let me show my screen and show you. So we call these uh, websites one-click websites because we want to make them very easy and here is the process on how you can create your, your own web website or for your clients. So the first thing you need to have is an IDX apps account, and that is easy. If you already have an iHome Finder account, you can have a free IDX apps account. So here is the here is how it looks. You you will have access to all these apps and the the app that we want to to use is Lead Connector One Click website. So here, it, if you don't have, let me let me go back a little bit. I need to fix something here. Just a moment. Website. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, the first time you enter this page, you will see this. You can see a live preview and you can buy the template. Once you once you buy it, it will redirect you to the um to the multi-step form. That it, it will uh, ask some questions to personalize your your website. And that's what we are going to do right now. So let's start. And here we have two designs to, to choose. I'm going to select this template, click on next. Let's uh, choose a, a, a name. Uh, I'm going to call it Colton Properties. Click on Next. Here, you select the apps that you want on your website. Click on Next. Here, uh, for the Plunk Home Valuation widget, it requires a phone number. So I'm going to select one and click on Next. In this step, we are going to connect high level. You need to click on continue with high level and select the sub account where you want the website to be added. We have a sub account named webinar. On next. Here we can select a contact form if you have one, but if you don't, click on skip. The next step is to select a hero image. We have a four to choose here, or you can upload your own image. I'm going to select this one. Click on next. We have the ability to create market pages. And for that, you need to select a city. I'm going to select the city and secondary cities. Okay, it will start creating custom values in your high level sub account. Let's wait a little bit. Okay, so once it's finished, you need to, to clone the template on your high-level sub-account. For that, you need to click on this link with agency admin permission in order to copy the website. At the website, um, I'm going to call it Fulton Properties, and I need to select the location that is the webinar sub-account. Clone website. Okay, so now I have a website clone with custom values is already there. So when I visit the website, the only thing I need to do is to uh, set up the domain, the same domain that I specify on iPhone Finder. I need to use it here. 
let me refresh this page. Colton properties, and these are all the pages that we have available. Let me go to settings, select a domain. I have already set up a domain for this, for this website. Click on save. Okay. And now we have a website, a high level website connected with iPhone Find. And this is very quickly, you can set up a, a website for your client. And in order to make the search work, you, we only need to go here and be sure that the paths are without any numbers. I'm going to update this page. And click on search. And that's it. We have a website integrated with iPhone Finder and in 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 time in record time. So this is what we want to we wanted to show you. We have also communities page communities. Um, we have widgets on the home page in the main city that you selected. We also have the testimonials with default testimonials that you can edit. And we also have um, other pages like communities. And we also have the property organizer that you can, uh, where you can manage your listings. If you want, uh, if you want to see a demo website, I can send you a, a demo website on the chat so you can take a look and see all the features. Sweet, Carlos, that's awesome. Let me see if I can do a uh, reaction here. Let's see if I know how to do this. There we go. I'm going to put a little applause for you there, brother. That was awesome. So one of our team members, uh, she's not on the call right now. So Diana, don't tell any anybody this. But Sonia says, "Why do you call it one click? That's not one click." I'm like, "Yeah, well, uh, you know, I'm a I'm a dad and a grandpa, so we can call it whatever we want. It's really like 17 clicks, as Carlos showed us there. But we still we we've, we've branded it as one click, and our goal is to make it a one click. But um, that's that's pretty much it. The other thing I wanted to mention that 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 when Carlos makes those community pages, is, is it loading those images using Chat GPT? Carlos, is that or was that where you got those community images, or did you have those loaded on the site already? For now, for now, they are the, uh, default images, but we are working on adding Chat GPT. Okay. We are working on the prompt to create the, the images. Okay, so it looks like he, Mike wants to see a, a link to the demo in there. If you don't mind sharing one. Does anybody have any questions about the one clicks before we hop over to what Maida's doing? I have a quick question on the pricing. So is the, um, do we pay for each client the 200 or, or is it something we would cop? Like what's, what's yeah, that's a, a that's right. a good question. Mike, right now, the way we have it set up, it's $199 to set up. And then the, you host it on your high level account. So we we're, we're selling it to our clients to replace another product that we had called pure IDX sites. And for that, we're charging 99 bucks a year to host it. We host it on our high level account, but we basically don't give them access to anything except the website. So they can't, text, they can't send any emails or any of that. They're not, they don't have high level per se. They just have a hosted website using that, that page builder. Um, but we are charging 199 bucks a site to spin those up. And, and then whatever you, your arrangements are on hosting or whatever for your client, it's there. And then Carlos didn't really go into all this, but you can also, as you saw, those are just regular pages inside of your uh, high level page builder. So now you can go modify those add more pages, remove some of those pages, whatever, you know, put your other logo on there or whatever you want to do on those. 